What is going on, guys? Goose here, man. We'll be going over the Houston Astros Seattle Mariners game that just ended not too long ago. A game which the Astros won in extra innings, two to one, when Yuli Gurriel. Wait, I'm sorry. Over here. Got to get the camera right. Over here. There's the picture. He hit the game-winning home run. They win two to one. So the Astros win, as uh, they they have they got a much much needed victory. They needed this victory in the worst way, uh, as they just have not been playing well. They had that they had to start off this uh, this series good against the Mariners, and they pitched well. If they pitched well, they I mean, they, they they pitched well, and it looked like that maybe they were going to fall on the short end of the stick there, even though they only gave it one run the whole game. But luckily. The Astros got the game-winning hit in the bottom of the 10th inning as Yuli Gurriel hits a uh, home run over the left field wall, and they win 2-1. to one. So Will Harris gets the win. He fell, he, I'm sorry, he proved the 2-1 and one on the year. And the losing pitcher was Festa for the Mariners. He fell to 0-2. Oh so yeah, both starters, and they, were, they were well out the game before this game was decided. And yeah, they both pitched well. I mean, I mean both pitchers, both Pitchers pitched well. Um, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go over the uh, Mariners opener. They had an opener that pitched one inning. I'm gonna go with the guy that pitched five. Malone. He went five innings, three hits. They gave up no runs, walked one, struck out two. And for the Astros, Wade Miley went six innings, gave up three hits, one run. It was earned. Struck out two, walked two. And he pitched phenomenal, phenomenal. And um, looked like he was gonna be. Looks like he was gonna be on the short end of the stick and get the loss, but. Josh Reddick stepped up and scored a, uh, excuse me, hit a home run in the eighth inning, which tied the game, and it helped the Astros uh, win this game. As uh, both teams, uh, you know, didn't hit the, they, they didn't, you know, they, they didn't score many runs. There was only two runs scored by the Astros, one by the Mariners, as it was one five and zero oh for the Mariners, two nine and zero for the Astros, as the. Mariners started off this scoring with a home run by Nola in the third inning. It stayed that way until the eighth inning when Josh Reddick hit a solo home run to make it 1-1. It stayed that way until the tenth when Yuli Gurriel hit a home run into left field to make it 2-1, and that was the game-winning run because extra innings. So the Astros win 2-1. Like I said, they get a much, much needed victory. They had to have this victory because they were playing. They weren't playing well at all. So it's good to see them bounce back, get a win, um, because they needed it. They really needed it. So they improved to 51 and 32 on the year. Um, but the uh, Rangers also won, so they kept pace. So they're only four and a half back out of the uh, division lead. But like I said, the Astros, they really, really needed this win. So tomorrow will be game two. This game will be at 7.15 local time. And it's going to pit Justin Verlander, who's 10 and 3 on the year. Against Kalucci, or Kachuchi. I know I'm pronouncing his name wrong. Probably, I apologize. He's four and five with a 5.11 ERA. Verlander is ten and three with a 2.67 ERA. ERA. So on paper, looks like this game this should be an easy win for the Astros, but games aren't played on paper. But I think this game will be. I think this game will be on Fox. So, so some people will probably be able to see this game. No, nationwide. This game will be on Fox tomorrow. So hope, hopefully, hopefully the Astros can get this win and get a series win because they desperately, desperately need to win a series because they lost three in a row to uh, to the Reds. They lost three out of four to the Yankees, and then they lost two out of three to the Pirates. So they desperately need to get this uh, series win against the Mariners. That they really need the sweep. Just to, just to get some positive vibes back on the team because they just have not played well at all the past like the past like two weeks. But they got a great pitching performance by the staff today. They really really needed really really needed it because the last few games, last two games especially, the pitching has been horrible. So they win two to one. So congratulations to the Houston Astros as they win and they proved a 51 and 32 on the year so hey uh, we got to keep pace because you know the, the, the Rangers are the Rangers are breathing down our backs mainly because the Astros have lost like but nine they had lost nine out of 11 going into tonight's game but 
hey, it is what it is. As always, guys, thank you all for watching. If you like what you see, like what you hear, give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Ring that notification bell. Click all notifications. As always, thank you all for watching, and I will talk to you all next time.